Right, so we've still got this basic ship, and we're going to blow up all sorts of massive ships and things, even with this one, without any danger whatsoever. So, um, you know, in the tutorial, you probably had a go at trying to shoot that sidewinder, and maybe did or didn't have much success at it. And you maybe felt that you needed to get the hang of that before playing the game. So you tried it a lot. Uh, when you see this slow down, what that means is you're being slowed down. It doesn't mean you have to slow down. So you can just ignore that. But be careful because when you get to the overshoot point, it comes up as well. So it sort of means slow down then. Because I'm talking, I'm going to get put it in a blue zone now. Right, now, once that top counter has gone below a thousand light seconds, when we open up our nav panel now, oh, we need to reset our filters. So everything comes back. Right, on this side now, this is what we're looking for. Resource, extraction site, high. Don't bother with the low. Don't go near the hazardous one at this stage of the game. Don't bother with one that says nothing. That just says resource extraction site. You want only a high one. Lock the destination. Oops, we've just gone past a bit. And what it is, it's just a position in the rings on that ringed planet. Let's hope it's not in the dark. It is in the dark by the looks of it. That just complicates things a little bit. But you'll get used to it. So you just fly there, just like as if it's a station so I'm in the blue zone so I'm not going to overshoot and once it gets to 1 million meters we get the safe disengage and we can uh, land there now a lot of people say oh I went to where you said and there was no ships there or there weren't very many it's because you dropped out the wrong place or you didn't target it if you don't find this I can't do it just now because I'm too close but if it looks see that red symbol to the right if it looks like that with two sort of brackets, that means you haven't targeted it, so target it. And then what happens when you get to one million meters, the blue writing will come up. So there is safe disengage. Only when you get that can you disengage. And that puts us right in the middle of the resource extraction site. So here we are, and you'll see already there's a lot of ships around us. Now we're gonna get trolled by FD. They they make all the ships you target fly away from you at first and things like that. So, just don't panic too much at the moment. So let's just get our orientation. Right, so we might as well get our weapons out now. So, if you just pull your trigger or something, or press the hard points engage thing. So, out come the weapons. And now, you can see these red squares. That one's just gone out of range, because I was about to target it. So, easy way to do it is, if you open up, now, you want to leave it on your contacts panel. There's a Python there. So have a look at it. There it is behind us. So just fly around and point at it. There it is. And just see it's gone out of range. They they do this in the beginning. It very briefly flashed up federal agent or something like that. That means he's a policeman. That line there is a miner. He's using mining laser on the rock. So if I target him, it says type 7. So anything that says type 6, type 7, type 9, they're all um, miners. And you get other miners as well. It can be any ship. But there's some that... It, yeah, there's that Python again. Federal agent. Clean. See that? Look on the right thing on the extreme left. Python, federal agent, expert, clean. Zachary Hudson. That's his boss, Zachary Hudson. So there's one flying away there. Who's that? This is Sidewinder. He's elite. We're scanning him. Just keep pointing at him. He's wanted. So if we shot him, we'd get the bounty. But the trouble is, as soon as we shoot him, he's going to start shooting us. So we don't want that. So just all you need to do is just watch for a bit. See what happens. And eventually what's going to happen is the police, like that python... There he is there. He's going to start shooting somebody. Who's that? A Viper. Another federal agent there. So once you've scanned them once, they'll show in your nav in your uh, contacts panel who's who. Federal dropship. Another federal agent. So we've got a whole bunch of 
threads over here. When you get that data, it's just, we don't need it at the moment. There's that sidewinder. These are payouts. Right, now to shoot something, you have to be within three kilometers of it. Otherwise, your shots don't land. Now, ah, look in the distance there. Somebody's shooting. So we could go over there. So you want to put four pips to engines and boost. See if we can get there. Where the, f the fire's focusing, that's likely to be where the target, right where I'm pointing. To be honest, I'd be surprised if we can get there. Because what happens is they troll you in the game. They make it always go to 0% just when you get to the position when you can fire. So I'm every time that capacitor, oh, nearly got him. That's him there. That's a policeman. So it's that one. Is it an elite cobra? Mark four. Be careful not to go into the rocks. So that cobra is a hundred percent. So there's more than one ship there. So who's that one there? Look, that one. It's an anaconda. That's a good start. But there you go, I told you, it's going to go to 0% just as we get there. Yep, he's gone. So that was a complete waste. But we got a big bunch of feds over here. So all the excitement's over. So that, if you look at the three columns, the capacitor's full now, so I'm ready to boost. You want to try and keep that full, but I don't know what's the best pips. You need four pips to the engines to get the maximum speed there was um, not long ago an awful lot of trouble with ships crashing into you but I, had, I haven't seen that recently the last week or so so I think they fixed that now so there we go over there now and we'll get there just as it goes to 0% but don't worry sooner or later we'll get to one in time and then they'll be all around us so when that capacitor gets full right up to the top, I can boost again. So it looks like that one. Up, no, it's still going. So we're going to boost again. So you need to be ready to shoot. So we've got our la lasers ready. As soon as we're within range, we're going to shoot. But you don't have to worry because nobody will shoot you back. So there's two things now you need before you can shoot anybody. It needs to be in range and he needs to be shown as wanted. And if you shoot him and you didn't see that he was wanted, you're going to be in big trouble. So it's the only thing you've got to look over. Oh, it's another anaconda. That's good. And he's got his shield still, so we're going to get there in time this time. So the feds are having a bit of a go at him. And they get on the radio and call up all their mates anyway. So more and more will come. Uh, we can take our time getting here. Now, I just want to show you something while we're waiting. I hope we didn't go down too quickly. Um, under sub-targets, if we just go up one, round about here, if it says it's got a fighter, you need to be very, very careful. The fighter, the moment you open fire on the mothership, the fighter will be on your backside killing you. So never shoot someone. If he's got a, a fighter, I'm going to put four pips to engines for a bit and let's say two to shields. So he's, he's halfway down now, so I'm just going to join in. And as long as he hasn't got a fighter, he won't shoot you. You can, And as long as he's fight, shooting the feds, he's not worried about you at all. No danger. Sorry, that's a big spoiler because it always feels like there's danger. Just be mindful that nobody gets between you. So if they do, just stop shooting for a bit, or if it looks like somebody's going to. So we can shoot away. It looks like we're the one killing him, but we're not. So we just got quarter of a million already. First ship we killed. If we'd got that other anaconda, we'd have an half a million now. And to get that trading, it's going to take you two weeks in a sidewinder, trust me. So, right, now, we can look on the... Oh, a nice Imperial Clipper. That should be worth 100,000, especially if he's got two Asps with him. Let's have a look. There he is. So let's see what it says. We can't shoot him, don't forget. 
is a wing of three, is a master, and he's wanted. You must have that red writing that says wanted if you want to shoot him. So there's an asp next to him. That's one of his wing mates. He's a master. In a wing, they're always all wanted or not wanted. So we know he's going to be wanted. But even though you know a ship's wanted, you cannot shoot it unless you see wanted. Is that the other asp? No, that's a cobra. Oh, they're shooting over there now. So who are they shooting? Oh, they're shooting that asp. So you can join in. He won't shoot you either, as long as the feds have shot him first. Something going on in the distance. So let's just wait a bit. So I'm just going to join in now. He won't shoot shoot you back. He's more all he's interested in is the feds. Really, when it says under attack, you're not actually under attack because it's just that means you've taken yeah, a stray shot from somebody. He's trying to get away, but he's gone down to 0%. So let's have a look behind us. So another 60,000. So who are they going for next? It's... That was the other asp. Oh no, must have been a different asp that one. So, oops. Where have they all gone? No, that um, that must have been a different asp, not in the wing of three. So, who's? You have to look round because they're going to be shooting somebody in a minute. We need to get there. So we've got our pips bucket engines ready to boost over there. Just have a keep looking around. Unless they got all the other three at the same time. Other two. So he's a policeman. There we go, over there. Let's boost there. So it's usually the one at the focus. It's always the last one you can target. Fair de Lance, Elite, is going to be worth something. So, watch the rocks. When it's dark like this, you can switch your lights on, which makes them show up a bit better. It's just dropped a heat, uh, heat sink, which untargets him. So you've got to be careful and make sure you get the right one targeted again when you come back on. So here we go. Can just shoot him. Watch all the other ships. He'll dance around. Just keep pointing at him. You know, I can do it probably a bit better than you, but because I'm a bit more experienced in my controls. There we go, 0%. He's gone. Another 155,000. Thank you very much. Is that that? There's an S. I think that was the wing of three. Oops, something going on over there. Yeah, it was the one in the wing. So they're still about. Feds haven't chopped them yet. That looks a bit far away. So these feds don't seem interested. Watch that. See that rock there? And if you bump it, you'll lose your, your shield. So keep try and keep a couple of pips to the shields when you can. Right, here we go. So, which one are they going for first? All at once, or is that a different one? You've got to be careful which one you... So, oops, where is it? That one there, that's an S. And he's chaffing, makes a bit too awkward. Getting quick, just in time. So 40,000. So you've got to figure out which ones they're shooting. Right, they're going on that, the other asp now. So we're now down to two of two. He's chaffing, so you can't target him. Be careful about shooting when they're chaffing, because it's, it makes the struts stray about. So we can shoot him now. Oops, run out of capacity. So he's gone. Now we want that. Yeah, he is right up there. Boost a bit. 
Let's see, get the right ship. You'll note that they never shoot you. It's something I discovered. That's what's different in my other videos. So all you need to do is keep pointing. It's chaffing at the moment. Just have to wait a bit. As I said, there's two ships that carry fighters. A federal gunship and an anaconda. They're the only two you have to worry about. So just check them. And if they have haven't got a fighter, as soon as the feds are shooting them, you can join in. So you can't start on any ship without the feds already shooting him. If you do, they'll shoot you back. So. Oh, he's still got his shirt. That's it, another 70,000. So, right, now we don't know who's about anymore. So you open up your panel. There's an eagle there. Everybody else is a fed. So let's just have a look at him, see what he is. So this points at him, and he's a police force, he's an allied police force. So we just got to wait around now. There's some shooting in the distance there, we could wander over there, see what's coming. So four pips, two engines. It looks like it stopped already. At this stage of the game, your trouble is your sensors are no good. You've just got E-rated sensors. So they don't show up things, you know, when they're at, at a distance. So there's an adder. He's a miner. Ooh. But this is what's happening with the, with the ramming. So you might want to put, when you're not doing anything, four pips to shields in case they ram you. Let's have a look on the panel again. So nobody there in range. So we've just got to keep looking around. So there's the actual sense of the resource extraction site. So what I normally do, I just look at the sort of plane of the rings. Like that. So we've had a message of some sort. You can just ignore everything. We'll have a look, see what it says in a minute. Just, I mean, it won't say anything that's useful to us. So, what does it say? Delivery contract. Yeah, they're going to give us 10,000 pounds, 10,000 credits. Oops, we're well done. Try again. That one. No. It's weird. It normally tells you. Oh, because I'm on filter. Right. Yeah, get 10,000. Well, you can see we've just made, we made like 250,000 just for shooting one ship. So, they don't want to waste their time making 10,000. Right, another thing is, if we look at the radar, the newly arriving ships often have a square top. What that means is they haven't got their guns out. He's just put his guns out now for some reason. So particularly when it's busy and they're coming sort of thick and fast. Each time you look behind you, you see one with a square top. Chances are that's a pirate. So you just turn around and scan him, ready. Everybody wandered off now. So it'll quieten down for a bit until some shooting starts again. And then all the feds will come back. They've just gone for their tea break at the moment. So just keep looking around uh, the rings like this, just sort of fly in a circle pointing at the ring. And when you see the shooting, you don't have to stay next to the center of the resource extraction site. You can be like 20 kilometers out sometimes as pirates still coming there, some shooting. Right, so boost over there. We we'll probably won't get there in time. So one of the priorities with outfitting your ship is to make it as fast as possible because the sooner you can get to these places where you see the shooting, the more chance you've got of getting the kill. But you'll see it go to 0% just when it gets to 3 kilometers. So just watch the capacity. I keep pressing the boost button that you can't boost until they're top down now I can go 
that obviously makes you go a lot faster. So if that's an anaconda or something like that, we've got a chance of getting there, but any smaller ship, they're going to kill it long before we, we get there. Well, sometimes if there's more than one, also it gives you a chance. It looks like there could be, so that's an asp. Dangerous, 41%. So he's wanted, so we can shoot him if we can get in range. Yep, we just made it. Hallelujah. Right, put a pips for the weapons. He's gone now anyway. Another 50,000. So let's have a look who's about. No more pirates. They're all police. Yeah, you see these materials. Uh, you can pick those up if you want. But um, if it's Horizon's version. They'll be used for engineers later. But to be honest... I think you've got quite a few things to do before worrying about engineers. You can get them at any time. So I wouldn't panic about them. There's another one. Another asp. But be careful because it's not always the asp that's the bad guy. It can be good or bad. Right, so he's going down. We've got to get there quick. More pips. So he's wanted so we can shoot him. Just got there in time. There's another one over there. So use the boost with four pips. So I've got two to the weapons at the moment. So I'm just recharging the uh, capacitor for shooting again. So I'm boost again then. So what you're aiming for is about a million. But there's no danger, so you can stay here as long as you want. Oh, it's a fair de lance. That's good. He doesn't fly away. Sometimes after making their kill, they turn up and jump away before the police come. Is he going to come towards me? I can't shoot him. But he's committed a crime, so the feds will be on to him. Just a question of when. There he goes. I'll just follow him. Yeah, if I shoot him, the, um, he'll immediately start shooting back. Actually, if the feds haven't already come, it means they're busy with somebody. So, yeah, there you go. They're busy with that one. As soon as they finish with him. Oh, it's an anaconda. And we've got a chance of getting him. As soon as they finish with him, they'll be on to that fair to lance. So, we need to, while we're waiting to get there, we need to check whether he's got a fighter. Yes. There, see it? So, unfortunately, unless the fight has already been killed, and we've no idea whether it has or hasn't at the moment, so we'll keep our eye out. So if anybody else is shooting at one of the feds, that's the fighter. So, there is still a get out. If you get him right when he's about 5% before the end. So in this case, we want four pips to shields and two to weapons just in case that fighter gets us from behind because they're programmed that the moment you open fire they'll be on your tail shooting you and then you're back to start make sure you've got the right anaconda when they, he drops a heat sink so you, you detargeted him what often happens if you wait to the end is you know they're about 25 percent you think oh well, soon i'll be able to shoot but then um they bump into one of the other ships and go down all at once so with no pips to the engines, I've got to keep full throttle on all the time to stay close. So it's 50%. We want to get him about 20% ideal. And that way we can weather the storm from the fighter until the rest of him goes, hopefully. But those fighters, they're really good. You've got no chance of getting away from them. Okay. We'll take him there. I haven't seen the fighter, so I think he's already been blown up. Oh, there he is, right on our tail. Did you see? He turns red behind us and see our shields are nearly gone. So we're in trouble now. We can't get that. There he is. So we, we've got to boost about a bit. So we've lost our shield, so I've got to get this. So our only hope is that, that anaconda is going to go soon. There he is there. Where is he? 6%.
0.0% that's it no. because we weren't within 20 seconds at the end we didn't get the money for him I took a chance on FIB you can see exactly what um, happens yeah his shields came back on just before he died and that delayed it all so that would be the third lance now so we can get him oh no it's a diamond back it's just chaffed so it's always dodgy shooting at um, the uh, a ship with a fighter. So that was a really good example. You can see see what happens. So none of the other ships will shoot you. It's just those fighters. But I kept looking and I didn't see anybody else shooting the feds. But those nasty fighters, they'd rather ignore everybody shooting their mothership and get you. They just hang around behind you. So he's wanted so I can shoot him. These ones won't shoot back. Right, who else is there then? There it is. So don't be in too much of a hurry to shoot. Just wait till you see wanted is wanted so we can shoot now. Yeah, the fact that he is wanted doesn't count. It's got to actually show wanted in your head up display on the left there. As you see winger three, you know he's wanted. So where's the other one? We got a message. Oh, we've been promoted already. So where is he? That one. So four pips for engines. It's chaffed again, so we can't shoot him yet. But he's wanted, so we can shoot him. Yeah, you do have to move the pips about occasionally. So if your weapons stop firing because your capacitors run out, then just put pips on there. So that's that's your most important control, the pips. So you need to get used to it and figure out what makes it work. And yeah, it's a general rule at this stage of the game because nobody's going to shoot you back. Keep you know, um, try and keep your capa all your capacitors full yeah, in between times. Nothing's happening. But, um, oh look, got the right one. Uh, yeah, so if I want to shoot him now, I've got to put um, four pips to weapons. But because of this business of ramming, you do need to um, keep four pips of shields when you ki when his ship's about. So we'll join in. Yeah, we're now mostly harmless, no longer harmless, because we we managed to get a few elite ones that that promotes you quite quickly. But what happens is doing this. When you've got to dangerous in the sidewinder, they, they won't shoot the sidewinder with these pulse lasers until you get to dangerous. And that's a long way yet in the game. So at this stage of the game, you can just practice pointing at them and shooting them and getting that right. The most important thing is shooting them um, only when they're wanted. That's the only thing you've got to get right. There's one over there somewhere. Just flew away. So let's have a look at the panel. Nothing there. So I don't know how much money we got now. So if we open up our transactions, 275 and 6. So we got 880,000. So we just want another couple of hundred thousand. That anaconda would have done it. That's the police scanning us. That's, that's when they ram you. You get scan detected and they can't stop. So it's normally a pretty good idea 
the moment it gets scan detected. Put four pips. So, yeah, when you're just hanging around, you know, target the ships with a square top. There's one just appeared over there. Where's he gone? There. That is a policeman. Just to check whether they're a pirate. There we go. We didn't see that fair de lance, did we, that we were found before? So, oh, four pips the engines. That could be him over there. That looks like a sizable ship. That's in the black dot just there, by the looks of it. Somebody just got him with a missile. He's got good eyes. I can see black blobs. So they must have got whoever it was. They must have been him blowing up. Right, anybody about? Contacts. Cobra, Imperial Eagles. Cobra plot fours. They can often be pirates. Maybe that was pirates, not police. And they've blown up a goodie. Yeah, ring of three pirates. So, might as well target them all. He's a policeman on his own. So he's not going to get far with three, one against three. So he's trying to so get another one. Oh, that's an anaconda's turned up to help him. So, he's getting shot. He is. That's one of the three. So try and figure out which one's going to get it the most. Well, they, they keep changing their minds which ones they're going to shoot. So he's getting it. And these two in front of me are getting it. So he's going down. So, so just see that anaconda flew in front of us. No, he's stopped now. So we four pips to engines. Go on. Put four pips to weapons, see if we can speed it up. But when they're in a wing like this and all the feds are all shooting them, you're lucky if you can get just one of them. So don't change from one to the other all the time. Let's go over there. Don't forget to wait, make sure you've seen the wanted. It's dead easy at this, like when you're doing this, to forget. You know, you, you may have managed to get a scan of two out of three before the shooting started. And then, um, you know, in your hurry to try and get as many of them as you can, you see all the feds shooting one of them and you go after him. And that's the one that you didn't actually get scanned. So it is clean. That's the other one, so let's boost over there. I don't know if we can get inside. Come on. Still got all his shields, but with all the feds on him, he'll go down quite quickly. Dropped a heat sink, so he said he's become untargetable. So if I'd had heat sinks when that um, fighter thing was on my tail, I would have lost him for a bit. But unfortunately, you have to buy them when we've got the money at the moment. Well, we, we have now, but well, we will be cash in. a little bit more. No other ships there. Let's have a look at our transactions. Seven. There we got a million now. So what we do? One more. Oh yeah, they're fighting down there. 
that ex a little bit extra always helps. So as you can see, we're like we were just 17 kilometers away from the center of the resource extraction site. Still plenty of ships to shoot out there. So just go where where the shooting is. There was some shooting in front of me, but it seems to stop now. Now, don't forget, this we haven't got any money at all yet. Um, what we have got is sort of bonds for bounties, bounty vouchers, let's call them. They don't count for anything. They're stuck in your ship. And if your ship gets blown up, you lose them all. So, so the only good thing is that as long as you stick to the rules. There is a bad guy that no feds about. Oh, here we go. Um, don't shoot anybody that isn't doesn't show as wanted, and don't shoot the feds. You'll uh, get to keep all your money. So that's. And the only other rule, of course, Imperial Clipper. Uh, we won't get there in time. The only other rule is um, the fighters. Don't shoot a ship with fighters. Oh, we're going to get him. We're going to get him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Just. That's amazing that um, I can tell you nine times out of ten, they go to 0% just when you get in range to shoot. Or if you're waiting for the scan to complete to show wanted, they go off just. They go to 0% just as the thing shows wanted. But you you can't panic and shoot beforehand. Oh, we've got a few ships. There was that, um, that one there. The Imperial Courier. This Asp turned up as well. Is he a bad guy or a good guy? He's good. So it's that Imperial Courier, wherever this guy's probably got out of range now. Agnew, there he is. The Fed should be on to him in a minute. There he is. Yeah, whenever you're following a ship, um, keep looking around because the Feds are very frickle. They seem to know when you're following a ship, especially if it's a nice juicy anaconda. And they'll be killing everything behind you all the time. And every time you get there, it, they go to 0% just before you can open fire. And then you go back following your other one again. Look, they're shooting one over here now. Now, if you do mess up and shoot something you shouldn't, you immediately get a warning with orange writing like when you do that boost and you can't like, like that, it says, he's a policeman, so it's not him. He's a miner, that's not him. So who are we shooting? There it is, Imperial Clipper. An elite one. Ooh, can we get there? Yeah. So he's wanted, so we can shoot him. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, if you do mess up, and you see that writing, uh, I've I'm going to add a section after this, how to deal with it. But the most important thing is, you respond to it. What you have to do, the moment you get a writing says you've been charged with assault, you have to turn around, four pips to engines, and boost away. Do not stay there carrying on shooting at the one you're shooting at. Because as soon as the feds are finished with him, they'll deal with you. So, okay, I think we got enough now. So, there's nothing to stop you staying there until you got um, 10 million. So, if you look at our fuel, what have we lost? One, one block of fuel so far. So, we've got over a million. Where is it? What was it now? We've got 11, 1,200,000, 1 1.2 million we've got so far. And we've used one block of fuel. So, you could get like 6 or 7 million just in one go if you wanted. Just stay there doing that. 
but the chances are you will mess up and shoot somebody you shouldn't so um you know oh there's a police uh, anaconda uh yeah so you should um cash in you know probably when you got about this much okay so what oh what, what you do when you're ready to go new ship turned up just there above us so there's the plane of the um ring you need to turn at right angles to it so it'll be up there that way that and norm sometimes you get this white sky where it where it tapers out there let's just see what that was that turned up no nobody um sort of up there somewhere is about there is straight up so after you've left the rings or even if you're like quite high up already you'll you'll see the mass lock go out on the right hand side there it's out at the moment so we're ready to engage our frame shift drive so in this case we want uh, super cruise uh, which we can't do until we've put our weapons away so put your weapons away and engage your frame shift drive and once going we'll we'll navigate to the station so full throttle to engage it come on there it goes. right so we navigate now you saw i didn't have to panic about anything the only thing that made me feel a little bit uneasy was that fighter which i took a chance on and it nearly didn't come off that could have killed me and if I hadn't had four pips to the shields, because I suspected it was going to happen, the shields would have been down immediately, and uh, then bang goes your hull, and back to start again. You, you end up back in, right back in that station where we started from. Oh no, we wouldn't. We would end up in the last one we took off from. So, not quite so bad. Um, but you don't lose anything, because you didn't start with anything, so you just lost what you would have had, sort of. Right, navigation. So we want the nearest station, which is Hovel Terminal. But same as before, we're going to get docking permission. I'm just going to boost towards the station, get there a bit quicker. Right, contacts. Hovel Terminal. Request docking. I'm with 7.5 meters. Right, see, this time we can't see the where we've got to go. So down thrust, four pips to engines and boost. See how quickly we can find it. As soon as that capacitor reaches the top again, we can boost again. But that looks like it there. Now there's two come up. So we need to make sure we get the right one. One and two will be next to each other. So it's the innermost one by the looks of it. So a bit of side thrust. You're the other way. Landing gear. Pips off the engines, otherwise it'll scoot about on a landing pad. Yeah. I've only just started using dual sticks and I'm still getting used to it at the moment. Right, so. Here we go, starport services. This is how we get our money now. So, just going to refuel while we're, we're here. Right, contacts. There we go, 1.2 million, thanks very much. And what's going to happen, we get message now, telling us we're great guys. Yeah, go on then. No, forgot. Might come in a minute. Right, so, yeah, there's no outfitting here. Where did I do the outfitting? I just can't remember now. Was it 